Delmarva Power, we are committed to providing our customers with reliable electrical service. So when strong weather causes damage that leads to power outages, we're ready with a plan and prepared to respond as quickly as possible. Weather conditions are a major cause of power outages. High winds, downpours, ice and lightning can all cause trees and branches to fall on power lines, damaging the systems we use to deliver electricity to homes and businesses. When a storm threatens, we're already preparing to address potential outages. We mobilize crews and make sure we have them in place should they be needed. If necessary, we even call in additional crews from other utility companies to provide assistance. When strong weather hits, our first priority is to keep everyone safe. Remember, never go near down power lines. A power line on or near the ground should always be thought of as live and dangerous. If widespread outages occur, we follow a specific power restoration process based on our experience and best practices for our industry tailored to our service areas. Now let's take a closer look at our process for restoring power. A passing storm can cause a wide variety of damage and no two storms are alike. Once conditions are safe for working and we have made an initial assessment of damage, we get to work on downed live wires and other life-threatening situations. Next, we work to repair transmission lines serving thousands of customers. Then we restore power to critical public safety facilities such as hospitals and fire stations. From there, we focus on substation equipment that helps us deliver power to communities. Main distribution lines that may serve up to hundreds of customers are next, followed by secondary lines that serve neighborhoods. Then we focus on individual outages to homes and businesses, continuing our work until power has been restored to all customers. It's important to note that unless we complete necessary work repairing larger distribution lines and equipment, we can't restore power to individual buildings. Regardless of what stage of the power restoration process we are in, technology helps us work faster and more efficiently. Fault detectors placed on power lines let us know where damage has occurred before we send out work crews. Smart meters help us pinpoint outages. Advanced switches give us the ability to shorten outages by quickly rerouting power. We equip our crews with mobile data terminals to report damage in real time and use the information gathered to determine when power will be restored to our customers. As restoration work progresses, Estimates may be refined, and any changes will reflect a more accurate estimated time period. Customers can go online at delmarva.com or use the Delmarva self-service app to view the restoration estimates on a mobile device. When power has been restored, our work continues. We evaluate our response and identify changes we can make to be even more prepared when the next storm comes.